Hello Aquarius, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly, weekend, sorry, weekly love reading for the week of October 11th through the 18th, 2021. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaids by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my... Um, Mermaid Tarot by Lisa Robertson. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Aquarius? Aquarius. Oops. Okay. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? So, I'm told to leave these out. So, these supposed to be out, and then I'm going to put them on the side. All right? So, I got the two littlest puppies in here, and y'all can see them. Hear them. They over there scrapping. So, apologize for that. All right. So, we got receptivity card here. So, I do feel like somebody has something coming in. Okay? Something, message, gift, something. All right? So, we got the guide card here. So, I do feel like somebody's been talking about these gifts. Okay? So, it's like, I think it's the everybody know except you kind of thing. All right, so whatever this is, it's an all of a sudden thing. So it's like something popped up out the blue, all right? I do feel like it's some kind of um, surprise. I do feel like it's grown-up activity attached to this, okay? So this um, make me feel like some kind of proposals are coming in, um, some kind of engagements, um, just some kind of getting together in relationships, okay? Um, some kind of surprises. Could be surprise parties, Um and all that good stuff, okay? Mm-hmm. That's what I'm seeing here. So, I'm supposed to put this on the side. I want to put it in, but they told me to put it on the side, so that's what I'm going to do. All right. So, let's see what's going on for the rest of us. All right. Goodness. All right. So, we got a third-party card <laughs> at the top coming in. So, this could be somebody maybe dealing with a third party, um, but this also could mean somebody trying to bring a third party into the relationship. I do feel like... Whatever's going on with this third party is known, okay? It's known by everybody in the relationship. All right, so we got the future fate card here. So I do feel like this is a life lesson, but I feel like something you don't want to go through, okay? You hear the dogs, there's going to be a lot of fighting, okay? So you bring this person in, I do feel like it's going to cause a problem, all right? All right, so we got the voyage card here. So I do feel like, come here. Come here. Y'all about to get put out. Come here. You about to get put out. Come here. You better be glad you're cute. No, she won't let me get her. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we got the voyage car here. So this makes me feel like um, somebody is thinking about moving in with somebody or uh, going on a trip with somebody. Okay. So this could be on some kind of trip. Somebody might be trying to do this third party thing. Um, or somebody could just be going on a trip with a third party, okay? Mm hmm But I do feel like this person was brought into the relationship. All right. So, we got the air card here. So, I do feel like this is an emotionally exciting but exhausting um, situation. I do feel like somebody's bringing people in, okay? Um, and I feel like... That, of course, it's going to be exciting at first, but I do feel like it's going to be exhausting later on, okay? Because it's like, okay, it's supposed to be maybe once every every once in a while, you know, but next thing I know, this person living in our basement, okay? What's going on, okay? What is going on here? All right, so we got the Under the Masculine card here. So this makes me feel like dealing with a very arrogant person, Okay. Very arrogant, very controlling and demanding, okay? I do feel like somebody wants to do whatever they need to do to make this person happy. But I do feel like it's getting ready to backfire, okay? Backfire. Alright, so we got the Sirens card here. So I do feel like we're getting a lot of messages on um, what we shouldn't be doing and what we should be doing in this situation. But of course, we're going to do what we want to do, right? Yeah, that's what we do. All right, so we got the trip card here. All right, so I do feel like some kind of moving um, was possibly getting ready to happen. I do feel like if this move does happen, I do feel like somebody's going to be moved right back out as well, okay? So you're going to be moved in, then you're going to be moved out, all right? 
Mm-hmm. All right, so we got the returns card here. So I do feel like, um, yeah, I do feel like whatever is going on with this third party is not going to stop. It's not going to end, okay? Um, I do feel like it might be somebody's um, childhood family member, childhood, hopefully not family member, childhood friends, but family member. I don't block nobody. I don't, none of my dang on business, okay? But it looked like somebody is bringing someone from the outside in into this relationship, okay? All right, so I do feel like care is connected to this person now, okay? To that third party. Oh, no. These are all jacked up. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. All right, y'all. Uh... Mm-mm. I've been watching TikTok too much. Sorry. I keep hearing pow, pow, pow. <laughs> I didn't want to get one, y'all, because I knew I was going to be addicted to it. That's just my personality. And I'm addicted. Okay. All right. So, we got this three of swords that just popped out here. So, I do feel like some heart is it, it, coming from this whole situation. Um, It's definitely connected to everything that's going on here. All right, so it's like somebody was doing something for fun, and I do feel like it just didn't turn out like that in the end. Okay, just like the aftermath is just this one didn't go in. Aftermath is is the part is the part. All right, so we got the Five of Swords here. Definitely, I was feeling that energy already. It's going to be a bunch of fighting going on here. Uh, just this card reversed here, so I do feel like some wrongdoing is getting ready to happen, okay? Karma, things coming back, okay? Balance will be restored. All right, let's see what's going on. Oh, no, that sounds like a pen being chewed up. Oh, oh, that's my lotion. One second. Girl, how do you find this stuff? Where do you get, like, I swear she got this little cubby hole in the front, and I don't know where she be getting this stuff from. You just hear some crunching, and she just got all kinds of stuff in there. All right, so let's see what's going on. All right, so we got the Knight of Wands reversed. All right, so I do feel like some kind of, this is like some kind of trip or some kind of movement not happening, okay? So this could be moving forward with a relationship. It could be slowed down or stopped because of this third party thing, okay? All right, so we got the full card reverse here. So I do feel like somebody's planning a new start. Mm hmm. All right, so we got the Emperor card here. So I do feel like somebody's trying to find some stability in uh, the relationship. And uh, yeah, let's keep going. Let's see what's going on with this Knight of Wands. This also makes me feel like um, some kind of negative message is being sent out. Okay, or somebody may be getting ready to get blocked. Okay. All right, they're going to have fighting again. So I'm about to put them out. All right, so we got the... Yep. Come here. Come here. Like, it's crazy how the little ones is, the, is always the mean ones. <laughs> Come here. Come here. You want some treats? I know you want some treats. I know you want some treats. Gotcha. Oh. All right. So now she going to bite me because I didn't took her uh, fight, fight night. All right. So we got the... Ten of Swords here. So this makes me feel like, um, yeah, a lot of betrayal happening after this. So it's like I trusted you to do the right thing. I trusted you to um, just ha make this thing happen or do your thing and then come back and be the person I need you to be. And that's not what, what's happening here. Okay. Wow. I should have put her out because she really fighting to get out of my hands right now. All right, so we got the two of swords here. Yep, so I do feel like in this situation, it was supposed to be a thing for fun, but now it's like I'm fighting um, for my spot, okay? So it's like somebody's fighting, um, fighting the third party. 
for their own spot. All right, so we got the Ace of Pentacles reversed here, okay? So I do feel like somebody's getting ready to lose something, okay? She, um, lose some money, lose product, lose um, a house, lose a car. Um, somebody could have been co-signed with somebody. It looks like here that somebody may take off with a third party, okay? And it's crazy because the third party was only brought in for some kind of fun. Okay, so definitely two readings here. All right, so we got the magician going on here reversed. So I do feel like it was some manipulation going on here. Okay, I let you bring this person into our house so that, you know, we can just renew things and, you know, have some fun. And then next thing I know, you won't stop doing the do with the person on the side, okay? And then now it's just like, you know, this person keeps trying to bring this person in or keep you know, mess around with this person and it's just like an ongoing thing, okay? And somebody has to make a decision on, you know, if they're going to sit here and take it or somebody's going to make a decision on if they are going to um, choose you or the other person, okay? You could be the chooser in this um, place as well, all right? Other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.